Good morning, everybody. This is Tom speaking. Uh, last week, I went to uh, editing, a.k.a. recording camp. And uh, if you're watching this video and you really like it, smash that like button and subscribe button. Uh, we're trying to hit a lot of views and likes, so enjoy the video. Every morning, we wake up at 7, eat breakfast, and go to the main track. Me and my group are waiting to uh, go on the big track. So the big guys are going first. They're kind of like professional people, so we're the starting little good group. I'm the one in the blue next to the fence. And I'm going on the big track with uh, my other friends. We're going down to the place that my group is needed. We go on these jumps. They're really high and fun to go. We did a few laps around to, to know the track better. And uh, we do laps until we go and do our lesson. Usually when we do this in the morning, we have all the groups come, the two groups, the big group and the small group. And now when we did, when we go around the track to find out where place, we do the lesson and when we do the lesson, we we'll practically have like a 5, 10, 20 minute moto. After we done, they give us practically free time according to the time that we have. Me, this is me jumping on uh, my favorite jump. I really like it and One who just jumped, he's uh, practically going to MPA. My friend of mine fell, and these are the good guys. So in the higher group, and the one who fell again, and the dude with in the KDM with the number 18 on it, he's the good, the good, AKA MP guy. This is me jumping. I don't really like this jump because sometimes I just, my feet just hurt when I land. The two bumps that I just did are fun because I do wheelies on them and everything. So this is when my parents came. I'm talking to my mother about everything, and this the blue truck is the watering truck because you don't want to have uh, dust all over. That's the dinner and the water station. And yeah, it's really fun. People just come, you park, you park your bike, and you go. And my little brother, he's gonna be a champion when he grows up. And we have practically a lot of time to go. And then after we take a water break, we have our another lesson. It helps us on the big track when we, we go on the big track, because we have a lot of big guys and small guys. In my group, I have like a lot of people who are older than me, but I'm faster than them. So I don't want to be rude, but that is true. So this is one of the small tracks, aka the small track. And I was here last year and now because the big track is full of different people. Uh, I'm, it's really hard for me because my bike has too much power for it. So I practically try to clear every jump. 
This mm -hmm. one that is coming up right now is the most coolest and funnest one here. Cause you never know what could happen. And the two jumps that are coming right now, they're like fun. You can clear them and they're fun and long. For little kids, they're pretty hard to clear because they have small bikes. They don't really water this truck that much, so it's pretty dusty. They really upgraded the track because the bumps that I just went on like two seconds ago, they weren't here last year. And this is when I really, really cleared, AKA over jumped that one. That, that is fun. And that's the back part of it. It feels really weird at that back part because it's a lot of blocks that it's hard on the corner. When you go, you try, you gotta try to go on the outside cause it's hard to go on it. Another MPA girl uh, overcrossed, which is pretty cool. Cash, the dude beside me, he has an 85, so he, me and him are the same bikes, but he has a Yamaha and I have a TM Racing. And it's pretty fun. And this is where we usually meet to, uh, to hear our lessons and all. And this is one of the really, like this is the coaches that are here. Practically at the end of the day, they usually have their free time. And yeah, the watering truck, it does. And the, that track where you see the gates, it's where we, the races start and all that. That's the, the one in the blue that just uh, was behind him. He is practically the best one there, almost. And this is where we're doing the starts, which is gonna help me on the end of October. I actually have a competition. And if you wanna see that, the video you better stick along and like the like all the videos and you better subscribe because you never know what's gonna happen and this is one of the the dude who helps everyone in if they have like broken tires because i had a, i popped like three tires this year and last year and this where we do a small race and yeah i'm all behind but it's better because it's not a race they tell us to never race only if it's like a championship because you got to know your positioning and forming the dude in front of me he has a KDM uh, in the in a few minutes uh, you will guys see I'm gonna be racing him not telling you guys who's gonna win so yes you better stick around for that moment and there he almost fell and I um, overcame him and here in our sticky situation when she was uh, sh when she landed the dude the the little dude called James he's one of my friends he has an electric he jumped on her which must be painful. And this is where we do the races. And this is me and him. The dude who I told you two minutes ago that we're gonna race. And right now I'm in the lead of him. So check it out. I was on my third gear, but then I was like, sticking like two, three, and four. 
But like, I always took the inside because if I go even once on outside, he's just gonna go in front of me, which pretty sucks on my last day of here, which is not comfortable. And here he's us at the back of the track. And here comes the big hill that it's hard to jump, but when you go down, you just go wee down. And this is me going crazy fast on my fourth here. I don't usually jump, cause like, they're just gonna go under me and that's not gonna be fun for me. So here is the back part of the track where I'm going. And that's where he comes crazy fast. And me just trying to block his way, so. And that right there is called winning a person who has a 122 stroke. So that's what you call racing, guys. Here we come in to see the bigger guys. So we are practically the last ones for the small group. And here you guys see the two twins in my group, which are pretty fast. They're faster than me when they're in front of me. Here I starting my bike to, to go because they were calling us in to say something about the last day. And they said that when you are in a competition, it's okay to lose, but like always remember that what we learned here, you gotta know forever. Cause if you're in a situation like racing, like I'm gonna do it at the end of October, it's better to know the positioning and have fun, not winning. But if you win, congratulations. And here is the end of our story, AKA my last week of Moto Park. And I really, really, really enjoyed it. My parents and some of my friends came camping. So it's a double bonus. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe and see you in the next video.